What's up guys, Vapor Cinema here with another quick little tutorial. This one sadly is recorded off my cell phone as usual. And this is a video on how to use Pinnacle Studios Ultimate Collection to edit a montage. It's a quick little tutorial, so watch. You, you capture your video by clicking capture, plug in your capture card, and you turn it on, you record a video. And when you record it, it comes up something like this, a bunch of boxes for all the clips, right? You find the clips you want in this list, click on it, and it'll open them all up right here. Okay, what you do to edit them and to add sound to them and do all that stuff, you gotta click them and drag them down here to the timeline. Okay? Puts one there, right? What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna right click on it and I'm gonna delete that one because I'm gonna show you an easier way to do it. You just click down somewhere in the blank spot, click and you drag and you can highlight them all. Highlight every single one of them, drag them down, set them there, puts them all in order. You can put songs on them too, okay? So to put a song on it, you click this little song button, sound button, whatever. You go through different albums, if you have iTunes or like LimeWire or something, you can download all of them from there and put the song in, and you configure it using the timeline. All right. You can also put in effects to the clips. To do that, you click on a certain clip, wait for it to open up, you double click on the clip, sorry, wait for it to open up, and then when this is, opens up, this sidebar will change. You can click this little bottom button right here, looks like a plug almost, and you can add all these different effects to the film. See, mine already has like the sepia old school tone or whatever that's called, sepia, but you can add a bunch of different things to them depending on which versions you have. You can reduce noise, you can chroma key it, you can dream glow it, you can do all these different cool effects, make it look all different, you can put multiple effects on each slide. To do that, just click on each one, and you can click select to all or just put on one. Okay, uh, what else can we do? Let's see, close this to make a title for your video. You click the little T over here. It's like a T for text, almost. Click that, wait for it to open. Once it opens, it'll open a list of all the different texts you can use on this software. You can use a bunch of different, like, moving texts and clouds and fonts and designs and all that stuff to put your title in your video if you want to use this, but I wouldn't suggest it. So yeah, if you have any other questions, comments, concerns, anything, just hit me up on the channel or mess or email me at vapor.cinema at yahoo.com. And let me know what you guys want to see next, man. Appreciate it. Rate, comment, subscribe.